Good morning, everybody. So I have something very special to show you today. We are at the Lyon d'Angers Stud. Uh, there is a dressage competition, and well, as you know, Topolino is is out of the out of the game for the moment. So I'm not riding, but I came with my friend Emily, and I'm coaching her this time. And um, yeah, this is such a special, special place. It's so beautiful, so many beautiful horses. <sighs> it's like it was very difficult when I when we got here this morning. I was like, oh, one year ago I was here with my horse, with Topolino, and we won, and it was perfect, really perfect. But yeah, life goes on, and I hope that. In one year time, I will be doing the same video, but this time I will be riding. So yeah, I will take you with me uh, on the rest of the day and show you this very, very, very special place. Bye! Voilà. So, if you respire, we do what movement? What exercise? Do the D'accord. D'accord, on, on va commencer sur du simple, on va commencer sur du simple, d'accord Et essaye donc d'être sur la piste, de faire des cercles ronds, ok Et euh, sans trop lui demander euh, des plis. Essaye que ce soit plus euh, le cheval. Concentre-toi d'avoir son encolure devant ses épaules. So I wanted to use a little bit this time to talk about my mindset on this moment. Um, I didn't think that it would be so difficult to be here without riding. But yeah, it is, uh, it is difficult and the thing is that I'm very happy that Topolino is doing well and that he's getting better and better every day. But it's like I don't know if, if we're going to be able to, to make it again, to be here again competing. And right now when I'm watching the pro levels, I'm also asking myself if if I'm ever going to be able to to make it because it's it's not easy and even if you try and even if you work for it and even if you give yourself it's not easy but yeah it's well it's not because it's not easy that I'm going to to not try um, I have to try I have to give give it my best and and yeah, things are going to to shape up and things are going to happen. I'm I have to be sure of it. So yeah, it is uh, a little mitigated. I don't know if you say that in in, in English. <laughs> it's like yeah, I'm happy, but I'm like hmm. <laughs> ah la 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 la. Fast forward one year when everything is going to be perfect and my horse Colin is going to be back uh, in his best shape ever and I will be able to bring you with me but as a rider. For now let's watch the pros. <laughs> We've lost the sun. I was so happy to be outside with the sun. Yeah, well. So yeah, uh, to get back to what we were speaking about is like, I love it to be here. I love it to be with my my friends, um, to see the horses, to see different people that I know uh, from this uh, community. But I really want to ride, and I really want to to continue progressing because the truth is that. Um, I've already talked about this on other videos, but it's it's like so so important for me 
um, the goal setting uh, course that I that I did on 2017 helped me so much so much to to grow and to become a better writer and and to get where I wanted that I'm just uh, I'm, I'm quite impatient to, to be able to continue on this uh, on this road but yeah there are other things that I have to that I have to take on account it's that well of course my horse is it's uh, we cannot I cannot work with him right right away like right now but I can do other things and I've been doing them and I think that yeah this is something that I I'm going to speak about a little bit more because I still have my goals even if uh, it's something that it has been put on standby but I still have them and and I know that I'm going to do everything that I can to to achieve them so yeah I don't know I'm rambling sorry <laughs> sorry oh beautiful horse So this is Soliman de Hus. Uh, he is the, one of the best sires here in France for the moment. He has lots of very, very, very good babies. It's like the, the best horses, amateur level right now, are his babies. <laughs> so yeah, this is it's a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful horse. And the rider is Marc Boblet and he was at the Hong Kong Olympics. I'm not sure if he participated on other Olympics. I think so, but I'm not sure, 100% sure. Uh, yeah. So good on the So we're just waiting for his turn, for him to, to pass, and then we will go back home. <laughs> <laughs> so our day is over here at the Lyon d'Angers stud. It was a beautiful day. Uh, we have an hour and a half drive, I think, and it's very hot, and I'm so happy. <laughs> I'm like the ants. We, I need um, the sun to be able to function. <laughs> So yeah, I hope you like this uh, this vlog. I hope you liked the, the place. Um, and yeah, I'll be speaking to you soon. Bye.